Welcome back, everybody, to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan, and today we are going to continue our adventures in the world of Azeroth and World of Warcraft. Well, we are in a very spooky place today, a very scary place, and that is the Karazhan Crypts. Now, I just got in here, um, and the way I did it is uh, I used a campfire at the gate, and I just killed myself with the Pinch Whistle Nitro Fuel potions. Um, and then you, you barely just get enough of your spirit over here on this side of the wall, and then you can revive yourself. So it's very simple. Um, you can also just have a mob go down with you and kill you. The problem is I'm level 70, and the mob is probably like level 20 or 40 or whatever, and so it can't attack me or do any damage. Or if it could, it would take years. So <laughs> I just find it an easier way to do this. And then, uh, yeah. So anyways, the campfire disappeared. But yeah, we're in the Karazhan Crypts. Um, I've always wanted to explore this place as I've never been down here in my life. I've always seen other videos of it. and uh, But yeah, I want to go explore it myself and see what's going on down here. This place is pretty spooky. Uh, it, so the Karazhan Crypts, from what I understand, was supposed to be... People speculate it was supposed to be a raid. And I'm assuming maybe it was a raid supposed to be a part of Karazhan. Um, that was going to have a bunch of bosses in it and places to go. The thing is, they never, they never released it and it was never finished. So, um, but what's interesting, once you come down here, the gates and everything on like doors, there's, you can still open them. So it's like they were supposed to open and work to begin with, but then this place was just never used. Um. But it's pretty amazing that you can come down here and check everything out. But yeah, we're going to go take a walk around and see what we can find. I do love this place a lot. It, I think it's really neat to get in here uh, and to see everything still here and intact. I'm surprised Blizzard hasn't done anything with this place yet. You would think that they would use it for like Halloween or something, you know. Where you do like a special event down here or... I don't know, just something different. But I, it, I just love that you can open all the gates, like even the ones that are in the ground. <laughs> I was, I don't know, I thought that was kind of fun. Obviously, there's nothing in here, as you can tell. But it's really spooky. There, there's, there's a an atmosphere down here that you don't get in the other parts of World of Warcraft. And uh, you know, it's a crypt. It's where dead people are buried. Uh, you know, like a cemetery. So. Of course, it's going to be spooky. It's going to be different. Um, but yeah, so we're going to head down to the lower parts of the crypt. And we're going to keep going. And we're actually going to take a left and then we'll take a right. So let's go explore the left first and what's down here. But I think this is where we started. Yeah, I think we just went in a circle. Did we just go in a circle? Man, we did. Okay. So anyways. All right, we went in a circle. So let's go back. <laughs> let's go take a look this way. As you can see, all the uh, the mummies and the skeletons on the ground, uh, the bones and all the creepy stuff that's down here. I wish this place came to life. I know a lot of people wish this place was actually active and still used. Wow. You know... I could really see like a raid or like a boss or something being in here. I'm assuming Blizzard had plans for this back in the day, especially back in the Burning Crusade when Karazhan dropped, um, because it was it was such a it was such a big dungeon, you know. And look at that! There's so many levels of this place. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me a lot of like Tomb Raider and like the level design of Tomb Raider, the game. Uh, like, you're supposed to be Laura Croft down here shooting the skeletons and stuff. But it's just so amazing all the details they leave in this place. And see, I believe it was supposed to be active at one point just because all the gates open and they're still active. So why would they keep stuff that's still active, you know? It just doesn't make any sense. Alright, let's go swim underwater. Ah, oh, it's freaky. Look at that. 
All the hanging dead bodies and everything. Oh my goodness. You know, <laughs> this place is something different. I mean, it, like I said, it's just a whole different in environment down here. Like, I'm sure they had something really big planned for this and they just never released it. I wish at one point they would talk about this place uh, and give it kind of like a a backstory. Unless there is a backstory to it and I just never realized. Alright, let's go swim under here and see what we can find. Hopefully we don't run out of breath and die, but I don't think we will. Nah, we're good. Yeah, there's definitely was something planned and bigger. Man, it's just these these rooms that just go on forever. There's the second floor that we came from. Or the top floor, whatever you want to say. Man, the Mountain of Bones. I always use my Demon Hunter to explore, just because, you know, like I always say in every video, it's the best class to explore and do things with especially with the double jump the metamorphosis the lighting i mean it just has all the best features of exploring there's not actually not much in this right here it's just crazy to me like how big this place is and how they left everything intact still uh so this is just supposed to be a side room right here I wish you could mount here, but I know you can't use indoor mounts. I don't think there's too much else to explore, but we can definitely go back up and see the upper level and see if there's anything else we missed. I don't think we did. Alright, we're just going to keep swimming back up here. Man, look at all that. It's creepy. It's creepy, creepy. Well, I think we explored everything. Unless I'm missing a lower level here. But I think that's that's it. I mean, that's pretty much the whole crypts there. Um... You know, I, I think it's really interesting that uh, they kept this place intact so much and they haven't actually removed it from the game files, but I'm just surprised that also Blizzard hasn't done anything with this place yet. You would think that they would turn it into maybe a some sort of Halloween special or do something with it. It's just crazy that it's just still sitting here, but I guess that they just uh, maybe are leaving it for the future. Who knows? Uh, you just never know what they're going to do with in the future, but all right, guys. Well, thank you for joining me on this Karazhan Crips adventure. Um, as always, my name is Nathan. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and uh, I will see you on the next one. Take care.